This is Danny Marie with Marlin May, and this is another video of Fran Bo. I'm just gonna keep on playing this game, because I'm getting, getting pretty far there. I'm getting like a bunch of text messages right now because I'm part of like a Pathfinder uh, group, and I'm supposed to start in less than 20 minutes here. <laughs> so let's see how far we can get. Uh, but just as a reminder, we had just talked to those twins, and they want uh, me to kill- they want to kill me and my cat. But they were going to make me uh, gather all these ingredients for this potion, and within the ingredients it says hair and blood from a black cat and the head of a young virgin, which I can only assume is Bran, and I'm, I'm assuming that's what they want us to assume. <laughs> Uh, so, we're just going around and, uh, trying to make it so that they don't have to kill us. Or tricking in them into doing something else. Um, let's see here. Yes, yes, Snoopy. There we go. Alright, so I get to go outside the window. And there's a big frog for me to talk to. Hey, you! Yes? Who's speaking? Me, I'm a toad. I have to tell you something. Yes, what is it? You're in great danger. Don't trust the girls. Why do you say that? Look, girl, I'm a toad. I know I can swim away from this place. But they won't let me. Every time I try to get out of here, I magically come back. This house is like a huge magnet. A toad and a cat magnet? They love us, but not to give us love. Just to use us. Don't trust them. That's terrible. That's why my kitty's here, then. They gave you a recipe for some kind of magic, right? How'd you know that? Did you see that dead girl in one of the rooms? Well, that could be you if you... Uh, that can be you if you try to do it. She tried, but she did it wrong. Oh my goodness! I think I'll... I'll think of something else then. I'm not a clever toad, but if I were you, I would be creative. Of course. Ah! Creative? I'll do my best. And girl, please save us all. I really want to get out of here. Alright. Got a plank of wood. Look at this bicycle. A rusky, rusty old bicycle in the middle of an island. A big, big rock. I'll leave it there. Alright. Moonlight on the water. You're so beautiful and calm. I always feel like the moon is following me. So I put this seed in the water. I remember this from when I played last time. A magical, magic blue rose. It grew, grew on the water. Because we need to find, uh, what I'm, what I'll be looking for is another recipe, basically. To trick them into doing that one instead. And, uh, you'll, you'll see. You'll see. I'll let you guys see. <laughs> Just gotta search around still. I get... Why is there blood covering the doll? Alright. Let's see. So what do we have? We have candles, tweezers, vase. Let's see. Where are you? Matchbox. Baking soda. Stairs. Ah, oh, those girls, they locked the attic. But how? I guess I can't talk to Mr. Midnight until they come back. Alright. I guess I should take these pills. I shouldn't be ignorant. <laughs> okay, so dead children. Oh, I, I see you have it comfortable there, little baby. 
Did your mommy drop you? I bet she did because she was sick. It's not your fault. You seem fresh. Are you still alive? You're a clever little baby. You took your placenta with you. Fran, how do you know what a placenta is? Plant. Climb all the way over here. Oh. I just wanted you to look at it. Hello, little baby. What are you doing here? Climb all the way back up. Because Fran just decided she wanted to jump. Uh, Fran. Uh, right. I can't get there from here. I need a bridge. Perfect, because we have a long wooden plank. Yes. There we go. Let's try this piece of wood. Alright, a secret bottle with a secret message. I can't lift it. It's too heavy for me. Use my knife. I cut the rope. Wonderful. Alright, climb all the way back down. Alright, she jumped. Let's see what's inside this bottle. <gasps> How dare you! Oh, okay, it's dead. How pleasant! <laughs> ah, that burned! Why? There's no fire! I can't touch the bottle, it really burns. All right, so I use the tweezers. I examine it. All right, so it looks like we already have all those ingredients. Uh, so what we need, well, I'll read it first. Revealing the true soul. The world hides the truth from you. Work your soul through life and you will understand the purpose of this act. If you try to corrupt this essence, your soul will be hidden and never see the face of truth. Deep. To destroy an um, impure soul or give freedom to those who are trapped, you will need... Blood from the executor of the ritual, five black candles, ashes to form a pentagram, a blue uh, blue bloomed moonlight rose. That's the one that I made uh, in the middle of the water. Is it, I don't know if it's a lake or something. Uh, salt and water, or salt and pepper. Uh, hair from the person you want bewitched. Draw a pentagram with the ashes inside the black and white square. Put a lighted black candle on every point of the pentagram. Fill a cauldron with water and put the other elements in it. Boil, pour over the person you want to bewitch, and repeat these words while you walk around the pentagram. I'm not even going to try. Uh, so, I need blood of myself, of the executor of the ritual, and then hair of the person we want bewitched. Which... So, I cut myself to get some blood. Looks really sad. I'm sorry, Fran. Wait, wait, we need your blood for the kitty. I like what's just dripping. Like, we don't, we didn't even collect it on anything. Uh, let's go upstairs. I think I remember seeing a brush in here. Am I wrong? I feel like I must be wrong. Where must we get their hair? I think I'm missing an entire room. Whoops, okay. We can move over here. I don't know why I'm just ignoring it. There is the dead girl. <sighs> Hello? Who are you? Can't you hear me? I'm Fran. Oh my goodness, the smell! Poor girl. Who could have done this and why? I need to be careful and protect my kitty and myself. Ah, a rec record player. I wonder if that works. <laughs> it's the ant guy. Alright. The Blueberry Tree Volume 2. Antonio the Greatest. So nice. Alright. Click the bookshelf. There's an owl. 
Oh, a typewriter, and it works. I guess I could write, but there's no paper. All right, so we're gonna trick them by actually writing on the, the ingredients list that they gave us. Hair from your head. So that I don't have to worry about stealing hair from them. <laughs> it's very obviously added in there at the end and they would have seen it, but this is the mind of a child tricking other children. The stairs end up in a wall. All right. I keep on, where do I want to draw this pentagram? Oh, I need to fill up the cauldron anyway. Here we go. Oh, Fran, here are the materials you'll need. Have you studied the ritual? Just a bag of bloody body parts. Yes, I'll need more time. I can't remember all the words. Oh, that must be the head. Well, learn them fast. Let us know when you are ready. The key. Psst, girl, I think you need to, uh, you need help getting rid of this bag. I can do that for you. But I may need it. No, you don't. Trust me. If we want to get out of here, this bag must disappear. I'll take it. You didn't see me. Bye. Alright. So picky about... Pattern. Okay. So, cauldron's all filled. I think I have everything but their hair. All right. We are waiting for you, Fran. Thanks. Do they want me to do it over here? I feel like that's the only empty spot. What do they want me to do? Let's read the instructions again. Uh, draw a pentagram with ashes. Why am I trying to use the fucking crayon? But where do I do it? I feel like I have to close that window. I don't know why, but. Just do that first, just in case. Don't wanna mess everything up. Why do they want me to put the pentagram? Why is it so hard? Maybe here? Oh, back. There we go, okay. I guess that is the best spot and is kind of pointed out. All right, drew a pentagram with ashes. Just need my candles. To light them. Um, and then... Use water. <laughs> okay. So it's a gas stove. So let that bubble. Need salt and pepper. The flour. And my blend. 
There goes my blood. I hope it tastes good. Tra la la. Oh, I need to ask them for the hair now. Come on. Look, ladies, there's something missing. I couldn't find your hair in the bag. Hair, you say? There's no hair needed. We know that. But look for yourself. It's written down here in the recipe. That's true. How could we miss that? All right. So gullible. There, now we are, pre now get prepared. I like just three strands. I'll let you know when I'm ready. Now it's four, but okay. We get to dunk it on their heads. Everything's ready. Let's go to the kitchen. Good. Let's go. She just looks terrified of things whenever people are moving. Doop, doop, doop. Alright. They're willingly standing in the middle of the pentagram. <laughs> Please sit down and close your eyes, ladies. Oh my gosh, I feel like a jerk. And now I'll say the words. Bon de ir ir cano ir ver beg ma something 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 something. <laughs> You're so cute, Fran. Wait a second. That's not the right spell. You tricked us. Yes, I did. But now I got the key. What have I done? Oh my goodness. This is not right. The key. Now I can free my dear kitty. I'm nervous. Sometimes walking just feels like it takes forever in this game. Alright. What is it, Fran? Open the cage. I can't. The key doesn't fit. Did you see another keyhole somewhere? Yes, I did. I don't know. I'll have to look around. I'll be waiting. Hurry up. There's a key right in here. Use it with the mirror. The key was the, for this keyhole. And what's this? A puzzle? Alright, and looks like that's all the time I have for today. Uh, this was Fran Bo, and I am Danny Marie with Marlin May. Watch for me next Saturday and also on Sunday with our next uh, last video. So, have a great night and thank you very much.